So although it's been warm this last week, there's obviously a significant ice shelf going on <laughs> in the shade along the river here. But uh, I'm gonna try this little pool here and then I'm gonna go downstream to where there's some open pools or open runs and uh, a little more sunshine and, and uh, see if I can catch anything. But I've got the 15 foot Rivermaster Z2 by ESZ. Like I said in the intro, I did a review on this, all the specifications and kind of my initial thoughts after fishing it on the Bighorn last week without my GoPro. So I wanted to come out this week and see if I can actually catch something on video with it. This is a common freestone river that I fish, but I haven't had good luck on it over the last year since the flooding. And it's very hard to see my line. I've got a 15 foot, actually a 13 foot, number three level line with several feet of tippet, 5X. There's one. Oh, it came off, darn it. Saw the line tighten up. There's one. Let's see what fly he took. There's the bend of the rod, you can see. Fairly flexible rod, 20-ish pennies, 20.5 if I remember. But for a big rod, it gets spread out over the, the whole length. It's not ultra tips. Tip flex. And I still can't see. Oh, took the bottom fly, the tungsten surveyor. And what do we got? Still can't tell. Kind of looks like a rainbow. No, nope. what is it? Oh, jeez. <laughs> it went zipping by me. I think it is a rainbow, but it could be a brown. It's hard to tell in the shadows. No, it's a rainbow. Get my net. That's a healthy rainbow. For a winter time frame, there it is. See seven and eight, it's a 15 incher. That's a good good start. Put my hands here. It's warm out, like I said. If it wasn't, I wouldn't uh, take them out of the water. But there's that, that fish. Nice. That's a good start. I'm up on this big chunk of ice here. Try a little bit of this lower section. I'm gonna have to get off it if I actually hook into something in order to land it. There's one. Wasn't sure if that was because I was moving or if the line was stopping funny. Oh, I gotta get off this ice chunk and hopefully it doesn't try to go under it. You can see the bend in that rod again. Feels like a fairly heavy fish. Oh man, how am I gonna get down here? That wasn't well thought out. to get down on my butt so I don't fall and slide off this thing while I fight the fish. There we go. Man, I haven't seen the fish yet. Might be a big old white, ooh. I don't know, it might be a big old trout. It's hard to tell, like I said, with a winter. You see the bend in this rod. I 
Yeah, it's a trout. Must be a rainbow. Yep, not a big one. And we decided to make one more run here. See if we can oh close the deal here. He also took the tungsten surveyor. Yeah, that's a healthy, another healthy one. Now he decides he wants to fight. There we go. They're all colorful. That's a that's a thick one. Thicker, so six and Almost nine, another 15 incher, approximately. Not that, right in the top of the snout. That's a pretty fish. Good job. Thanks for playing, buddy. So I caught another 15 incher just as my battery died. So I'm just going to release this pretty little rainbow. And there it goes. Well, welcome to the Bighorn, everybody. This is just a little side channel here. Uh, parking lot's right over there for this access. I'm going to try to nymph this a little bit and then maybe cross so I don't have the sun at my back and casting a shadow. I have heard a couple gulps or rises here as I've been rigging up. I did see one down below there that I might try to swing a soft hackle through depending on how things go up here. Well, I came upstream a ways. I wasn't having any luck down there. Didn't see any activity going on. I did see another fisherman up here that was wading up through these shallows up above. So he already came through this run. But that's the thing about the bighorn. You can find spots to fish, but it may not be virgin water. There's one. Oh, there's a nice rainbow. Oh, he's going. There you go. That's a healthy one. You can see the bend in this ESZ 15-footer. I do have 4X, so it's not like I have tiny tippet on. But you still have to keep a bend in the rod so it doesn't straighten you out. Looks like you took the, the sow bug. As I can see the scud up above. Come here. There we go. Fat guy, let's see, he's eight and four, no, eight and five, 13 inches, and fat. Let's take a look at him. There he is, a little chunker. There he goes. And just like last week, he took the so, bug. so I had the camera off for the last 20 minutes because it was so slow. And then I just hooked one as I came up a little further in this run. I saw it come up splashing. I'm not sure what it is yet though. It's a, looked like a pretty decent size anyways. Although it's just sitting there at the moment. Trying to back out slowly and get it into the shallow water here. Got a full bend in this rod. Except for I got this tree right behind me too. If this hook comes out, it's gonna shoot right up into the branches. Oh, it's, yeah, it's a, oh, it's going now. Oh, yeah. It's 
It must be a big fish. Oh, it's going. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, it is. Looks like it might be wound up around the tangle a little bit, but I can see the outline of it. It's a big fish. Which is why it's fighting funny, I think. Oh, I felt it hitting the line. Maybe it's coming untangled. Oh, that's a big brown. Nice brown. Oh yeah. That's a nice brown. So what we got? Nine and almost ten. Nine and nine. It's at least eighteen. It could be nineteen. Let's get over here and set my rod down. It's not tangled now. I, I felt it twitch a couple times. It must have come out undone. Untangled. I'm here. There's the hook. There it is. I have to use my hemos here. There we go. Oh yeah, that's a pretty fish. Hopefully this thing's not in the way. And then recover for a second here and I'll take it out and get a good look at it. There it is. That's a big fish. Okay, that's a long fish. There he goes. All right. Well, sorry I didn't have the camera on for the strike, but I'm trying to conserve a little bit of battery as slow as it was. All right. I was hooked into a big one. Hopefully I have my camera on. Oh, this is gonna break me off. It's gonna break me off. It's a big brown. I had my camera on. I thought it was already off, but maybe I caught the, had the take on camera before I turned it off thinking it was already, it wasn't on. Oh, it's a rainbow actually. Thought it was a brown. It's just a big rainbow. It's a good one though. Had a full bend in the rod, especially when it was running downstream. I had crossed over to the opposite side. I was fishing over there, just wanted to try this seam on this side and I guess it paid off oh yeah that's a really nice rainbow come on hang on hook the first 10 seconds were a little iffy with this guy the way it took off Okay, let's see if I can grab the line. Oh, come on. Come on. I'm trying to get him upstream of me so I can drift him back to me without pulling against the hand lining against the current. It's a... oh, oh. Oh, oh, yeah, that's a fatty. Holy cow. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> After all that, big old rainbow. <laughs>